Hey everybody, well, it is June, um, and June means that it is time for ICAD, which is index card today. Um, today is June 2nd, and I'm already behind. <laughs> um, it's been an insane two months. We are trying to sell our other house. We've been moving my mom into a different apartment. We've had the, you know, all of the busyness of the last few weeks of school. So my kids are now in summer vacation. Um, it, it just goes on and on and on. I um, haven't done anything creative in what feels like forever. So I'm hoping that uh, doing these cards will get me back in my groove. Um, I was so busy, I wasn't even able to remember to get out to get some white index cards, and I found these down in my basement. So, you know what? I've got a million of them, and I'm going to use them. I at first thought maybe I wouldn't, but these are, I've had these for quite a while, so they're actually a little bit thicker than um, some of the ones that you can get now, so the quality's you know pretty decent and I usually cover these with gesso anyway for a first layer so I really don't care that they're colored so I've got my big O stack cards and um, be sure to check out um, you know the index card a day uh, web page the, the site she um, has all sorts of prompts that you can use if you want to they are completely optional I usually don't do the prompts um, I usually just kind of do, I just do whatever, whatever feels like I want to do that day. But she does have all sorts of prompts. She has a weekly theme and then daily prompts. So there's oodles of inspiration there for every day. Um, we actually went to the zoo yesterday. So I usually kind of try to incorporate maybe something that's going on that happened that day into my card if it's something different that we did or if it's a holiday um, my anniversary always falls during ICAD so I always do a special anniversary card um, but since we went to the zoo yesterday I grabbed a map and I think I'm gonna use I'm gonna use this for my first card so I think I'm gonna use the inside of the map from the zoo and then I was looking through um, my drawer I spent the past two weeks reorganizing all of my um, collage elements and all of my cut words and I will be doing a video on that to show you how I did that. I purged out tons of stuff that I didn't need and it feels really good to just kind of have what I know that I like and that I know that um, I'm going to use. But I knew that I had some animals that I had pulled out of some magazines and I wasn't 100% sure if this guy would fit on a card. Um, you know, the way that he is, because I really like how his hand, his hand, <laughs> his uh, flipper's sticking out like that, so I thought it'd be fun to put something on his flipper. So what I decided to do was I grabbed a piece of um, watercolor paper, and I just laid, I'll put that back together, I laid an index card on top, and I just went around... Um, with my ruler and my craft knife and just kind of cut out a mat so that I'm pretty sure I'll probably use this maybe many times during the next two months during ICAD. But now I can lay this over anything and I can see if what I want to cut out will even will fit onto a card. And I think it's going to work. So I'm going to go ahead and cut this guy out and as I was trying to think of what to put in his flipper, I was looking through my drawer and, um, you know, since it was at the zoo, I kind of want to keep it the theme of being at the zoo and not just use any, any sort of a title or anything like that. So I think um, I'm going to put a watch in his flipper. So this is my folder that's full of watches. And one of the other things that I did when I was going through all my stuff is I cut out all the extra, all the extra paper from around a lot of the images. So that really cut down on a lot of the bulk um, of paper that was in my drawers. So I think I'm just going to pick out one of these watches 
and place it in this flipper. And um, I grab some letter stickers. And this, the, you know, the title, um, Time Well Spent, something like that, because um, we spent the whole day at the zoo. It was me and my um, three, my, I called them the lower tier of my children. <laughs> it's my two youngest and then the middle child. We went to the zoo with um, one of my daughter's friends. So it was, you know, definitely time well spent. So I think that that will work, you know, for a nice, fun and simple first card, just to kind of hopefully... Uh, get me going back into the groove of being creative and thinking creatively and um, yeah so I'm going to finish that and then hopefully later um, today I'll do a title card because I like having a card that just says you know for the beginning of this set of cards um, I want to do a card that says uh, ICAD 2016. So hopefully I'll get that done later today and definitely this week I will get the video of how I have all of my collage elements organized. So I'm going to speed this up the rest of the way and I hope you enjoy, enjoy these. Hopefully I'll have a, a video for almost all of my cards. Um, it usually gets harder during July because uh, vacations and things like that but I'll definitely be sharing photos on my Instagram and I'm packerdie underscore at on um, packerdie underscore honest heart studio on Instagram also so be sure to follow me there and um, we'll get started thanks everybody <laughs>